it depends on which level and uh, and it depends on on uh, also on how do you see internet if you see internet as um, as a user or um, or if you see it as um, from the perspective of an organization like ours that is uh, that is managing one important resource of the internet the the user interface of the internet what takes you from uh, thousands of networks into the web that you know that's what Eigen does so if you look at the user side what I will see so not as an Eigen but as an internet user what I will see that is the largest threat is um, this this closing of the internet original openness and this experience of a space that was by and large, by far and large, created as an um, open space where everybody could connect and innovate and join into a place where more and more your spaces are either privatized by uh, big network services, um, social media platforms or, or commerce platforms. In a way, they change a bit the nature of the internet as uh, only people that started 10 or 15 years ago using it uh, seeing it. Is this, is this a threat? Well, my personal view, more than a threat, is an evolution of the internet that um, in a way worries me because from being this one single global um, place, let's call it like this, it becomes more and more um, privatized, localized space where uh, people have different experiences depend on when they connect. Uh, they have different experiences depending on which service they use and they end up being silos in different environments. As a, as a technical organization, so as a, mem as, a, as an employee of ICANN, the biggest threat that we see is, um, well, and here I can open another big um, subject, the way that we manage the evolution of this um, internet DNS, the system of unique identifiers, is this multi-stakeholder model. And it was born with um, a bunch of network engineers at the origins of the internet. And it was a bunch of network engineers you could fill in this room. Soon after they became millions. And nowadays we have how many millions of users? Around three billion, something like that. But the model is still the same, it's still the same multi-stakeholder model. So the risk and the threat here is how to scale this model and how to get more people aware that this user interface that allows you to navigate to the internet, which is the DNS, actually needs to evolve and needs people to participate to evolve that. If we don't do that, then we risk that this key part of technology is lacking uh, the different inputs and the variety of inputs of all the users. And for me, this is a threat and uh, it stifles also uh, the evolution of the whole internet.